How to Mix Polyethylene Glycol 3350 If you're preparing to use polyethylene glycol 3350, whether it's for constipation or bowel preparation, mixing it correctly is key. Let's break it down step by step. First, you'll need to decide whether you're using the individual packets or the bulk bottle. If you're using packets, each one contains a single dose, so you just need to pour the contents into a cup. For the bulk bottle, use the measuring line on the bottle cap to measure out the right amount, which is usually about 17 or one heaping tablespoon. Next, choose a liquid to mix it with. You can use water, juice, soda, coffee, or tea. Just make sure it's about four to eight ounces or 120 to 240 milliliters. Pour the liquid into the cup with the powder. Now stir the mixture well until the powder is completely dissolved. This is important because you don't want any lumps or undissolved powder when you drink it. If you're using flavoring powder that comes with the medicine, add it to the cup before adding the liquid. However, don't add any extra flavorings or starch-based thickeners, as they can interact with the medicine. Once it's all mixed up, drink the solution immediately. For bowel preparation, you might need to drink 240 milliliters every 10 minutes until you finish the entire solution or until your stool is clear and free of solid matter. If you're giving this medication through a feeding tube, make sure the powder is fully dissolved in the liquid before administering it and flush the tube well after. Remember to follow your doctor's instructions carefully, and if you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask your doctor or pharmacist.